We begin in Iowa City, where progress on the new University of Iowa Children's Hospital is picking up speed now that winter is over. Construction crews are nearly halfway done with the new hospital structure. And CBS News reporter Brittany Borgi got a behind-the-scenes look at it today. Brittany. Yeah, Tiffany, if you've driven through Iowa City in the last several months, you can't ignore all of the cranes and construction going on here just across the street from Kinnick Stadium. The new Children's Hospital middle will have 14 floors, two parking levels below ground, and 12 hospital floors above. And as the building grows, so does the excitement here. We've got mounting enthusiasm, so each and every day people are excited to, to walk by the site, see what we're creating, and knowing how it's going to improve everything we already do. And from the top down, that same sense of enthusiasm and pride is here as the crew picks up the pace. It was a very difficult winter. Um, we, we worked all winter long. They split each floor up into three concrete pours and then let it set. We're doing about a pour a week. That means we'll finish that level in about a month's time. So we're doing about one level per month. That means getting to the 12th floor by late December or early January of 2015. I got to climb through all five floors with a little creative ladder work to get between levels. They will eventually transform from this jungle of support poles to a network of support, including eight operating rooms and 32 prep and recovery rooms just for kids. We have our, our nurses, anesthesiologists, and surgeons do great things, but they share the space with patients of all ages. So to be able to have, it, be able to have an environment that's just for the families and just for the kids, we know it's going to elevate the, the overall experience. There are actually 500 kids, family, and staff working with the design team on elements like space, color, and room size. It gives us confidence that we've got a design that's going to meet the needs of the families and our staff. That gives the crew even more pride no matter what level they're on. I kind of say it's the, the best project going on in Iowa right now, and it's, it's really neat to be a part of it. Really, we're creating a space for, for patients and families uh, that's going to be really special and really unique in Iowa. And for the record, it's taking nearly 200 construction workers to get the building into place. And while the structure should be set by the end of this year or the beginning of next year, the entire hospital in itself won't be open until about the spring of 2016. Covering the corridor in Iowa City, Brittany Borgie, CBS 2 News.